Hey everyone, I'm Noah Cap, and this is Noah in Niagara. Today, we're slowing things down in the Niagara Benchlands. Steeped in wine country and just an hour from Toronto, Niagara is a perfect destination to unwind and explore with that special someone. And today, that special someone happens to be me. I am robed and I am ready. My first stop is the spa for some of that sweet, sweet self-care. Hannah, how are you? I'm fantastic, how are you today? I'm great, this is wonderful. I just got the Sea Holistic treatment. Oh, that was wild. Good. Exfoliation, massage, facial, I mean the big three. Another hard day at the office. It was super relaxing, I feel great. I know it's a luxury, but we really do have to take care of ourselves more. Absolutely. You know? There's probably a lot of people at home, specifically some gentlemen. Oh, hello. I didn't see you down there. Who are nervous to like experience these types of treatments and things. Definitely. Get out of your head. <laughs> exactly. Self-care is for everybody. This is a standard part of a manicure? Yes. No, 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 just come back to me for a second. Just right up here so that everybody understands how wonderful this is. I just feel so pampered, so spoiled. Today's a good day. Thank you. I mean, right? Not gonna lie, it's hard to leave the comfort of this robe behind, but it's time to connect with nature. The Niagara region is home to thousands of acres of picturesque outdoor space for you to explore. I opted for a light hike here at Balls Falls, but Niagara boasts hiking trails for all skill levels. Did you know that Niagara is actually home to a unique Carolinian forest zone with more flora and fauna than any other ecosystem in the country? This is actually the most biodiverse forest in Canada. After a morning at the spa and an amazing hike, I'm ready to eat. So I'm off to one of the oldest wineries in the region, Vineland Estates, to meet with Chef George Ward for a crash course in wine pairing. Hope that's for us. Absolutely. Nice to meet you, Noah. Nice to meet you too. Thanks so much for having us. We're going to talk a little bit first. I'm not going to look at the food and dive right in. Uh, you've been here what? How long? Over the course of 16 years. Always a passion for food? Yeah, I've always known. Yeah. I always watched my mother and my grandmother cook, and when it came time to decide what I wanted to do with my life, I uh, decided to work in a kitchen. Talk to me about the concept behind the menu here. We do everything in house, and we source everything locally. This dish here that we're starting with. We smoke the beets for about two hours, and then we top it with some torched uh, upper can of the cheese curds. We have some um, two-year-old prosciutto that we make, black garlic aioli on there, fresh gala apples, some edible flowers. You've already paired up our wine. So we have a 2021 Elevation uh, Riesling. Great mineral quality. The sweetness of that wine really pairs nicely with the saltiness of the prosciutto. Yeah, that's nice. Now I want to build the perfect bite here. I guess the answer is a little bit of everything. A little bit of everything, yeah. A little bit of the prosciutto. Beautiful beet. Look at that. It's an impressive dish. Chef, uh, talk to me about the dish that we're looking at here. We have braised short rib and our bucatini pasta. So on the bottom there, we have a uh, whipped ricotta from Upper Canada the Cheese. We have the Lee's red wine bucatini pasta that we make here. Lee's, what is that? To spend yeast cells and the leftover particles from winemaking. You found a way to repurpose that? Yeah, absolutely, we dehydrate it and then add that directly to the pasta dough. We use an extruder to extrude the bucatini. So we have a 12 hour braised short rib, preserved tomatoes, and then we finish it off with a little bit of extra virgin olive oil and some fresh basil crust. The ricotta, the short rib, the tomato, the lees, the pasta, all local, all right here. All local. There's obviously a beautiful wine pairing to go along with. So we have our 2020 Elevation Cabernet. So this pairs really nicely with the dish. Acid loves acid, so the acid and the lees are really complemented by the acid in the wine, the fresh fruit. Cheers. Enjoy. Wow, that's nice. That's a big, beautiful piece of that short rib. Look at that. Oh my goodness, I've got some on the fork. Yup. Mm-hmm. That is a beautifully prepared pasta. Don't be offended. This is a genuine question. What's the feeling on doggy bags? <laughs> yeah, you can definitely take the rest of that you to go. Man. Yeah. Jeff, thank you. Uh, spoiled rotten. That was unbelievable. The food, the wine, uh, honestly, just an absolute pleasure. Thanks for coming and visiting us. Oh, thank you, Chef. Honestly, I didn't realize how much I needed that. Discovering Niagara has given me time to relax, time to enjoy nature, and time to spoil my taste buds. The message is clear. Visit Niagara, Canada. In the meantime, it's me time. <laughs>